How's it going, everybody? Arthur Reyes here at WarnersandWarners.com, and today we have one MLB game we're going to be discussing for the Tuesday, October 3rd, 2023 slate. But before we get into that, I want to talk to you guys quickly about a promotion we are running over at WarnersandWarners.com, where you guys can save 60% off on all of my packages until further notice if you use the promo code uh, FRDHITF60. That is all one word, no spaces. Make sure to go check out my profile as well as some of our other top performers on the website. As in addition to this free video that you guys get for on YouTube.com, you guys will get access to my written picks, what I'm betting on throughout the day, so you guys can always be in the know. Also, in the description below is a link to all of our affiliate sportsbook promotional signups. So if you guys are in the market for a new sportsbook, if you guys just want to take advantage of some free bonus bets, make sure to go check that out today. The link is very simple. It shows you which sportsbooks we offer, what the bonus bet for each bet or each uh, for each sportsbook is, and a link to the sports book in question you guys will get uh the free bonus bets we get an, an affiliate bonus for you guys using our code so everybody wins at the end of the day so yesterday we had the seattle seahawks to win outright they did that pretty easily we didn't even have to sweat so let's continue that streak let's get a win here today we're talking about game one of the nl wild card round we're going with the late game as we have the miami marlins taking on the philadelphia phillies uh, we have some NL East matchup here. It's going to be Jesus Zazardo on the mound for the Marlins, and it's going to be Zach Wheeler on the mound for the Phillies. Now, I don't like to be the whole stickler for what guys have done in the postseason, but this Miami Marlins team, they are young. They have not really made a lot of postseason experience throughout their roster, as they have some experience this team did go to the 2020 postseason but that was three years ago uh this phillies team has gone through the wild card round they did make the world series last year so i just think that they are more equipped here uh if you look at zach wheeler's postseason he's pitched five games or excuse me six games in the playoffs and he is pitching to a 2.78 era in those games, he did also pitch game one of the wild card round last year, where he pitched six and a third scoreless innings. So I just think he is more equipped to do well here. Uh, this Marlins team without Sandy Alcantara on the mound is a little bit more of a question mark for me. I think this Phillies team is going to do well uh, throughout this game. I think they're going to be able to hit. I just don't trust the Miami Marlins to do well on the road in their first playoff game in a full season in a while. So go with Zach Wheeler and the Philadelphia Phillies to cover the run line here. That's all I have for you guys. Make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe if you have not already. And I will see you guys in the next one.